Now we're going to learn about F connectors, how to strip a cable and how to attach the connector to the cable securely so it can be used. Let's take a look at the connector first. You can see that there's a hole in the middle. Um, that's where the uh, dielectric uh, and the center conductor will fit through and poke out the other side. And the nice thing about an F connector is it's very inexpensive um, and it's easy to assemble. Okay, let's take a look at the cable next. We have the right stripper. Insert the cable into the stripper. Give it a few twirls. You can hear it cutting through the, the shield wire. And I'm just going to make sure that this is a good cut here. Let's remove the stripper. See the center conductor. Pull the jacket off. And here we can see the rest of it. This is the braided shield on the outside. Let's look inside here. One of the first things to always check on these is to see if there's a piece of the braided shield that's wrapped around the center conductor. That will cause a lot of problems for you, so you want to make sure that that's not there. If you do find it, that's generally an indication that your tool is getting a little bit dull. Let's fold back the braided shield in preparation to put on our connector. Let's inspect it to make sure we have it all. Alright, now we're ready to put on our connector. So you can see that there's a center hole in the middle. And this is where the center conductor and the dielectric will fit inside this middle hole. Then on the outside, this is where the braided shield will go. We'll fit the connector onto the wire. And this is pretty tight, so we'll have to give it a good push. Now if we don't push it enough, you can see what's happening here. Is we want the dielectric to be flush with this well in here. So we'll push it. Now you can see how the dielectric is flush here. The next step is to use our crimper and we've selected the right crimper here for the tool or for the connector. We'll open up the crimper. Place it in the jaws. We'll give it a good squeeze. So make sure you go to the gym first. Get a firm tug after it's after you've crimped it. Make sure it's on there nice and snug. Make sure that nothing's changed. And there's an F connector. F connectors. They're still in use in the industry, mainly for inside uh, CCTV in buildings. And if you have a nice sharp tool and a good crimper, you'll be in business.